another day, another dollar with your homeboy Jermaine. Getting this video started off in the city already on the line with Caviar. Going to see what action I get with Caviar. Seems kind of slow this morning. I've already been online for about 10 minutes and I haven't received a request. Usually you go online between you know 10 30 and 11. I get a request in no time. One or two minutes tops, but now it's uh, a little slow. Maybe I should switch Uber Eats on. Uber Eats might be the one that's popping right now. Now the bonuses start on Uber Eats at 11, and right now it's 10.50, so I think I wanna wait 10 more minutes. Well, the boost is only 1.3, so that's not that much higher, but 1.3 is better than 1.0, so I think I'm gonna wait well, I got another nine minutes to wait now. I think I'm gonna wait going along with Uber Eats. It's gonna be a short morning for me. Um, I got a few other things planned in the East Bay and I'm just gonna knock out a few deliveries. I also gotta like just run a few errands in the city. It's another reason I decided to come anyway. Doing deliveries in Oakland in the daytime is pretty dang slow. I thought about doing deliveries in the East Bay this morning and said, look, let's just go over to the city and cross my fingers I don't hit crazy traffic on the bridge and yeah I did not hit crazy traffic on the bridge now I gotta cross my fingers again that I don't hit crazy traffic like leaving the city um, cuz around what 132 traffic begins to pick up it's not really crazy but it begins to pick up let's uh let's get this party started man what's up with caviar it's like slow Uber Eats is I'm gonna have to wait to go online with Uber Eats. I don't know, I'm giving you guys an earful right now. Just accepted the next delivery and I'm gonna have to freaking go through the mall. It's gonna be one of those pickups. All right, just came in, went all the way downstairs to check. It's gonna be 10 more minutes on the order. So what I'm doing now is just gonna go back to the car, make sure it's cool. I may actually circle around the block just to keep it on the safe side, keep myself entertained. Alright, back at the car here, and looks like everything's good. I don't know, I have to see. Maybe I'll just uh, hang out here in this spot, or or maybe I'll have to go, you know, circle around the block. Maybe I should just circle around the block, because I think I see one of those meter maids coming. Alright, it's 30 minutes later now. Still here, still parked in the same spot too. I haven't seen a meter maid go by. This order is taking forever, forever, and I can't wait to see what the payout is for the restaurant. Well, I know the order is the $24 order, but I can't wait to see what the restaurant delay pay is. I'm sure it'll be like $1, and I've been here for like 30 plus minutes. It's gonna be like probably a 45 minute wait just to pick the item up. Now the drop off location is not that far away, but I still have to like fight crazy traffic, so it's still gonna take some time to get there. This whole delivery will probably take like maybe an hour and 20 minutes. We'll see what the payout is on it. I don't know how come Caviar don't dispatch the orders when the food's ready. Like, they're still making the food. Why do you have the driver drive to the restaurant to pick it up when it's not even ready? This probably would not have happened on Uber Eats unless it was one of those, like, one of those, like, you know, Indian restaurants in the TL. They're always really, really slow on Uber Eats. But Caviar, come on, guys. You guys need to get on board. I mean, this was like an 18 item order, so you should know that it's gonna take some time to prepare the order. I mean, I can see if it was one item, but this is like a large order. Like I would, I mean, come on, I'm stuck. done ranting here. This is for sure the slowest place on planet Earth. Now they're waiting on a drink. Like it's been 40 minutes now. He said come back in 10 minutes. I'm just waiting on a drink. Like all the whole 17 items are prepared. They're waiting on one more item, which is a freaking drink that this is just ridiculous. One more order down. There was no suite number or floor number, so I just called the customer and the customer came down and met me. I love it when that happens. On another caviar order now, I'm about, what, 15 minutes from the restaurant, and this order has already turned into a batch order. Nice, double orders. It's like, what, I think it's $17 payout or something like that. I'm making some change for lunchtime. At this other pickup now for the two batch orders. Cross my fingers that both of these joints are ready. I can just, you know, walk in, scoop them up, take them away, drop them off, and uh, what time is it? I'm not wearing my Apple Watch today. I feel naked. I feel like I don't have clothes on. I'm not wearing my watch. Like, I, like it's, it's usually dead half of the time anyway, but I still feel weird without wearing it. Yo, you guys really gotta get a kick out of these elevators. <laughs> this joint is so classic. You can come in here. 
sit your items down, push the button, and then just sit down. Look at that thing. Look at look at so old school. And as, as you're riding up to drop the delivery off, you just sit down, chilling. Look at that. I'm straight sitting down on the elevator. Like it does not get better than that. It's got a mirror in here. You can make sure you're looking good before you get ready to go out. And, oh yes. This is it right here. I can't believe I'm sitting down on an elevator. All right, time to go back down. The customer like met me like pretty much as soon as the elevator opened. Check out this menu. I'm guessing this is from back in the day because it says like a steak is what? Simon $3? Yeah, this is from back in the day. Nice, one more delivery down. We um, still got one more with that batch order. And that delivery is going over to North Beach. North Beach is not that far away. There's not a lot of traffic over there and hopefully parking won't be a nightmare. And I don't think that there's a lot of traffic in the area right now. There's not a lot of tourists around. It's low season. I'm sure there's a lot of elevator scenes today. I'm just showing them off, man. Check this out. You guys want to hear something that's just ridiculous? Remember the first restaurant I went to that took forever? Another request just popped up <laughs> and I just accepted it. So I'm going back to that same restaurant, super slow restaurant. We'll see how long it, it takes this time. I actually think it'll be a lot faster this time only because it's a little bit later and I showed up like right at 10 and I'm sure they had a lot of large orders coming in and this next order is not that big. This is like two or three items. So uh, yeah, this one should go much faster. It's about that time to go back to Oakland. Man, the traffic is not on my side. Looks like traffic is a little thick. But you know, it actually flows around too. It's 2.22 now. I wanted to leave by two, but I'm still around. Yeah, traffic is flowing. It'll, it'll be a minute, a little bit longer than usual. <laughs> Yo, crazy. just out, doing a little meetup. Let's go get some food. We're meant to make it happen. I'm gonna this take is, you to my favorite spot. This is a trip to the both ways, right? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, what's the spot we're going to? Right so it's now? one of my favorite spots. It is called the Golden Lotus. It is in downtown Oakland. The Golden Lotus, the so they Golden got some Lotus. good vegan food. They do. Yeah, well, you vegan, 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 sort of vegan, 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 vegan. Here we go. Here we go. Let's go up in here. Let's go. Does it go this way? So I don't know, how come we didn't vlog that much today? We just hung out, like we didn't even vlog. We were supposed to hang it out was, and vlog. We started to. I, I captured did. us walking into the restaurant mm -hmm. into Golden Lotus. Yeah. That was about the extent. <laughs> That's about all the vlogging we did. And ever since then, we just been like just talking and chilling and just doing everything else. And yeah, I've, I've had a blast. Every You don't need to pull out the camera all the time, right? We actually were just in real time. Real time's fun. We were in real time and... There wasn't any snapping, living. I didn't go live anywhere. You didn't go live at all? <laughs> no. I didn't go live at all. I like never go live. T-Mobile sucks, so I never go live. You on Instagram live? Yeah, well, I'm sure it probably sucks too. <laughs> it's my internet, because T-Mobile is so slow. I need Verizon, but Verizon's like, what? I have T-Mobile, but I'm not a billionaire, so I don't have Verizon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, Verizon's got that really good internet. And it, Verizon got that billionaire internet. <laughs> got that real like, internet. <laughs> yes. No unlimited at all, dude. I need mm. the unlimited data. I use so many gigs. Like every month, I use maybe like ten gigs of data or something. Wait, Verizon doesn't unlimit you? I don't think they do. If they had unlimited, I'd probably. It'd be, be like three thousand a month. Yeah, at least. Yeah. <laughs> at Pretty least. much, you'd have to stop and work at Verizon. <laughs> <laughs> Be like, yo, let, let a brother get a discount on that plan. Lake Merritt, and then we went to Overland, took <laughs> you to the first and only country bar in Oakland. Yeah, country bar in Oakland. Yes. So we went there, and what did we see when we went there? A whole bunch of your friends. And? Oh, yeah, your name. <laughs> <laughs> your name on the, the what do you call that thing? The, the billboard? The marquee. The marquee, I call it a billboard. <laughs> <laughs> it would be a billboard if it was outside. It is a billboard, right? It, it is a billboard. It's yeah, just inside. it's an door. Yeah. Yeah, we walk in and there's like, <laughs> the marquee was already done. I loved it. That was super dope. That was yeah, awesome. It was so, pretty dope. In case anybody wants to come to Oakland, 
or any place in the Bay Area in Silicon Valley and learn how to country Russian line dance in case they want to skip over Nashville and skip over every place Nashville. Else that offers country and come to Silicon Valley to learn it, I'm the person for you. Yeah, you can learn some country. No, not country. You can learn to country line dance. Line dance. Country Western line dancing. Country Western line dance. Two stepping and square calling. Ooh, two stepping, square calling. Yes. Ooh, like a boss. <laughs> Get some Luke Bryan, you know, Shania T- Twain, Tim McGraw. We do it, you know, we do it like that. A little mm. bit. A little bit of Miranda Lambert. We do it. Mm. I'm going to have to catch up on my country skills. It goes down. I mean, I'm from, like, you know, the country capital, but I don't know. I just got to catch up on my country skills. I know we Garth have Brooks. We to do a, a video with you line dancing. Oh, gosh. <gasps> oh, my gosh, guys. Like and subscribe. Comment thumbs up. Make a comment below. All of that good stuff. So if we get uh 50 people <laughs> to comment <laughs> that you want to see him line dancing... <laughs> We will do that video. Oh my God, this oh is gonna gosh. be so dope. I think we're gonna get the 50 people to comment. 50 <laughs> people, comment and be like, Liberty, get your man to like this. <laughs> See, it is when you're moving. When you move, it goes out of focus. It's a camera. Let's, let's do it. Oh, out of focus. We're not here for like an oil painting. <laughs> I, I know, I know, I'm just, I don't know. <laughs> I'm a vlogger, I look at stuff like that. <laughs> I know, but I want people we got to get you to country western line dance and teach you a really good line. Have you ever line danced before? No. <gasps> 50 people. Thumbs this video up. Make a comment and say, Jermaine, get your cowboy boots. Country western line dancing with that take, girl. I would get them right. I mean, I'll give it a shot. Like, I, I won't. I'm not going to knock it. I'll give it a shot. It'll be fun. <laughs> I'm sold. I'm sold. I, I, I'm down. I'll give it a shot. Okay. That sounds good. You Tell heard me. it. Just so he can't go back and be like, I didn't say I was going to do that. Girl, I don't know what you're saying. Right here. You heard it. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> back at the house. Now, earlier tonight, I changed the focusing settings on the camera, and wow, it is a whole lot better than it was earlier. I had it on tracking. So on tracking, it would just follow your face. So if I like move my face, it would follow. But in this mode, it's just, there's no tracking and everything's in focus. Like there's no, nothing should be out of focus in the background on this mode. Let me see if this is this out of focus. I don't know if that's, I can't really tell if that's out of focus. I'm gonna have to watch the video to tell if it's out of focus. But yeah, I'm just sort of playing with the different modes on the camera and seeing. How this works I'll probably vlog in this mode tomorrow just to see you know what it's looking like what it's looking like but I kind of like the facial tracking mode because it gives the the blurry background I can't tell if this one's blurry or not but I really like the blurry background especially when I'm like walking down the street it just looks really cool when I'm walking down the street and it's like super blurry and there's like a person like next to me and you can tell it's a person but you really can't see them because they're blurry, you know? So it's just a feature like I really like the whole vocal effect. But for now, I think I'm gonna get ready to call it a night, lay down. I've had a blast today. Get ready to do it all over again tomorrow. Adventures with Jermaine. Thanks a lot for watching. Peace, like, comment, subscribe.